It is the show that makes dreams come true tomorrow. The famous turning chairs are back for a brand new series of The Voice. Okay. I would turn up just to see you, Sir Tom, just, just <laughs> on that. Um, and my friend, this year, big year for you, big birthday coming up. Yep. Um, and, and you still tour, you still sing. You yes. Yeah. Same thing. Same. Well, it's brilliant. Yeah. Can I, tell oh, yeah, people, yeah. can I tell people how old you are? I love it. Well, I'm going to be 80 in, in, in June. Wow. Amazing. And how will you spend your birthday? Uh, same as I do all the other birthdays <laughs> so far. <laughs> Just have a few, you know, a few drinks. Uh -huh. Friends, family. And have you important. never thought of retiring? No, no. Retiring? No. But I can't believe it, you know, when people say, well, how old are you now? I got a 60 to... Uh, uh, wait a minute. No. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a, unbelievable. It's a state of mind, isn't it? I think so. Yeah. No, but for you, it would have to be a state of voice as well. Well, yes. Yeah. That, yeah. I'm, I'm lucky in that respect. The, the voice is still working. It's uh -huh. still loud, loud and clear, and uh, and I still love to sing, you see, so... And we love to listen doing? to you. It's, it's I, I think we've you. been to see Tom more than anybody else, actually. We've a few times, yeah. yeah. We have um, a few times. Uh, absolutely, but always a privilege to see you and hear, hear you perform. Well, sitting next to him is a I privilege. I was going to say, that must be you know, when inspiration. You, you see that VT there of me and of Tom singing and, and obviously Megan's dad getting up and performing, like, even for me, myself and Will and everyone in the crowd, it's just like... Just sat with Sir Tom. Just like well, actually, actually, you you two can be a bit of a double act here as we get to form <laughs> into this. What do you see for this? Oh God. Lovely, I lovely. love I love yeah. those bits. We love it. it. Just kind of happened. You, I just know because I, I'm sing. I'm a huge Sir Tom fan, so I'm sat there like, come on, Tom, let's just sing a song or get him <laughs> yeah. to sing a song. So I just, yeah, I just encourage. Well, him we to have, do we have a lot of fun. We have a lot of fun on the show. Don't we? Ah, we yeah, we, we love working together, but it's it's just a great show to be a part. Of. I think not just you know the other coaches as well with Megan and Will, mm -hmm. but also the, the the crew, everyone that works on it, the contestants it's bring lots of energy. It's a great show, so we feed off that even in Sydney. And also, you got to remember we. We're sat in them chairs for hours, aren't we? Like, oh, yeah, well, bl blind auditions, you know, they go on so we like, for a long time. But it's, it's, it's great to listen to young voices, new voices. I love mm. it. Yeah. What are I, you listening? What makes you turn, Tom? It all depends. It, it, it needs to be real. You know, it needs to be something that you, you can feel coming through. Mm. And it doesn't have to be the same kind of voice. It just needs to be real. And, and that's, that's the, the only... So would I... what would the, diff the other judges be looking for? You're looking for real. Yeah. What would Megan be looking for? What would William be looking for? I, I, I think we're all basically looking for, the, for reality, but in, a, in our own realities, you know, the way we, the way we hear it. And, um, but, but it's I, hard I, to explain, really, because you, you're kind of looking for something unique, something different, something you haven't heard before. The only way I can liken it to is like listening to the radio when you hear someone for the first time, or in your car and you're driving, yes. and you go, God, who's sure. that? Mm. And I think... When we're sat there, we can't see them. All we have no. is the all we have is the audience in front of us. So all we have is our ears, and and you, your your ears are really sensitive. Yeah. So if it's slightly out of pitch or it's out of tune and it's not yeah. quite right, you're like, oh no, I can't turn. And that's why you, everyone at home goes, why did you not turn? Yeah. Well, can you not say that's what I can work on? That you as a coach, course. that's what you're going to work. Of and then, course. You know what about? I mean, you're the winner from from last year. I mean, uh, how, you know com that? how competitive? <laughs> no, really. We won the last two years, by the way. We're yeah. the with, 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 with the team. Well, we were, yes, we were in the, in the final. Both of us were. Mm. Yeah. So how competitive will you be going into this? <laughs> um, well, Megan, Megan's super competitive. I didn't realise that. I thought she came in all sweet. I was yeah. going to say, how's she fitted in? Because it's quite Jennifer Hudson's quite big shoes to fill. Of course. Mm. And, of course, we, we love Jennifer. She was amazing. Yeah. But I think it's... I mean, I don't know if Tom thought this, but when someone new comes in, it does freshen it up a bit. And someone new to talk to, it's great to hear her stories. And we had some drinks before the main show, the, the blind started, and Megan was like, oh, my God, Ali, like, I don't know how am I going to fit in. Like, are people going to love me? You do like, that very well, don't you? <laughs> <laughs> what can I... What, what, she sounded a bit like that when she... She doesn't sound anything like that. <laughs> and she was asking us about what the battles are like, like, can you give me any advice or the blinds? And, I was, and me and Tom and everyone was like, yeah, yeah. that's what you should do. And she's like, oh, I don't think anyone's going to turn for me and no one's going to pick me. And then and straight off the bat, yeah, we went into away. the uh, battles and she was just like, 
pick me and everyone picked her. And we were like, what? She's great fun. Yeah, she's she? great yes. fun. She brings a great energy. And um, what, what about um, when you all perform, the four coaches? Do you do, are you doing that again this year? Yeah. Yep. Yep. Are you allowed to tell us what? Um, I don't think we can. I haven't been told we can, but it's, it's a great opener, but oh, there you go. I was oh. absolutely petrified. Well, you can tell us because we're seeing it. Well, I was <laughs> petrified. Well, there, there it is. There you go. Look. I've got the music in me, is it? Yeah, i got the music in me. And um, I've just had knee operation, and they got me walking down the stairs, dancing at the start, and I'm thinking, oh, my God, I'm going to do my knee I'm going to do my knee in again. <laughs> um, but it was a great performance. You've got to watch. That's what I... Yeah, it's the great man. <laughs> Where does that come from, Sir Tom? Where does that come from? Does it get harder to produce that for you, that unique sound? No, thank God. It's, it's, it's very natural. Mm -hmm. it's, and it's still there. Because that's, I think that's when people say about retiring and packing it in. But if my voice is still working as well as it is, thank God, then, then why? You know, why, why, yeah. why give it up? Because it's a natural thing. Yeah. It comes out mm -hmm. and it's still doing it. Mm -hmm. So that's it. Do you change and, and adapt what you sing? I mean, someone like Rod Stewart, you know, when he had some lar larynx operations mm. and whatever, and, you know, he then, you know, he does that American songbook stuff, which has been very successful. Yeah. Him. Do you find yourself adapting or changing or would you like to? Um, no, well, I've, I've always been... I've always liked a lot of different kinds of songs, yeah. different kinds of music. So mm -hmm. it's, I've never been stuck in a rut, you know, I've never been in one area. So, and, and, and I like doing that. I like listening to, to new things. Uh, sometimes they've been recorded by other people, but I, I, I don't like to say, oh, well, they're covers, because I feel it's, when I, when I sing it, it's my interpretation. Quite right. Yeah. I well, love that. Yeah, I love course. people reinterpreting Elvis, reinterpreting Johnny Cash, whatever. I just think it's brilliant. Yeah, as long as you don't copy, as long as you don't no. yeah. try to copy, do your own version of it, then, then um, it is a new song. Guys, love to talk forever, but we can't. Um, the Voice returns tomorrow night. We'll see you on there. You'll be listening to plenty of new voices there uh, tomorrow night at half past eight there on ITV. Guys, thanks very much. And Happy New Year to both of you. Yeah. Pleasure. Happy New Year. Great to see Happy you both. New Year.